Hello everyone and welcome back to another live Polynerdic playtest. Obviously we're taking a look at the Star Wars Battlefront 2 beta. Uh, before we get into it, I see right here on the main screen something that has been irritating me about video games for a long time. And it's going to be in this one too. There are fucking crates in this game. Can't get away from it, can we? So I might as well just open this bastard. Let's see. Oh, cool. We got advanced torpedoes. Tactical jammer. Advanced capacitors. All right. Daily crate. Get this shit out of the way. This has been a hot button topic in the gaming media. Uh, check out Jim Sterling's latest video about uh, crates on uh, Shadow of War. Middle Earth Shadow of War. This is getting ridiculous. Alright, we've got tuned lasers. Crafting parts. I don't even know what the fuck we craft. We go in together. Trip mine for the specialist. Okay, big deal. Alright, and of course you can buy them. Well, because why couldn't you? And how much you want to bet the, uh, the currency? <coughs> Excuse me. Is purchasable. Let's see, I've got some currency up there. Let's see what we got here. <sighs> All right. Now that we've done the blind box bullshit, let's actually take a look at this game here. I've played a little bit of it. Let's see. We don't have the beta. The beta or the beta doesn't have campaign in it, so we're just gonna jump into multiplayer here. Let's do a little galactic assault strike, since that's the main mode that's in this beta here. As I said, I've played a, a fair bit of it tonight. I didn't get to play a lot of it this weekend. Uh, this was my weekend with family. So I, I didn't, you know, have the Xbox to myself. It was, you know, another Overwatch weekend. So I, I'm really anticipating or looking forward to this game. Uh, I quite liked the first Battlefront, but as everyone knows, it did not have a player base for very long because it was such a limited game, it being strictly multiplayer. This I enjoy though. This is this has been pretty fun. Um, I uh, haven't really got a hang of it. I'm not really good at it. I'm not horrible for the most part. I have had some bad games, but uh, it's pretty fun. This this strike mode, if you've not seen it yet, is just a simple defend some points. Or first you first you have to try to stop. If you're playing as the clone army, you got to stop the robots from getting forward the trade federation um they've got a big troop carrier coming down this middle middle avenue and you've got to hit it with ion blasters and then everyone's going to shoot it with lasers and then obviously if you're playing as the trade federation it's the opposite but uh and then once you get to the palace once once they reach the palace back there in the background then it, then it becomes a matter of uh but just in time of, uh, stopping them from taking the control room. Uh, this is a thing, though. You like, obviously you can't shoot the people. Uh, there's some ducks and birds and stuff. You can't shoot them either. So if you're looking for that kind of nonsense, this isn't for you. It's not a bad-looking game. Uh, I'm I'm suspecting that the final version will look better. This does look like a very early build. Not great. I don't know what the hell I was caught on there, but I couldn't move more than just a little bit. I don't know if I was caught on shrubbery. Okay, cool. Question is, do those burn? I don't like the uh, the respawn at all. The way it does this, and then spawns you. Just, just fucking let me back in. As you can see these are the ion disruptors. There's icons here. That's what we're trying to get. And then once they hit the ah oh, shit. 
I fucking hate that close range shotgun. It's one of the cheapest weapons in Battlefront, and it, I, I want to say there was something similar to it in the original. As I said, there's birds out here you can't kill. My kids thought that was hilarious. Going, asshole. Good lord. You need plenty of time to shoot it. You run around this way. The ion weapons are working. Common grenade. Well, see, it locks back pretty quickly. And then it, then it becomes a getaway situation, a flee, a retreat. Back at it. Ah, all right. Get it here. There we go. Does seem like it would be a lot of fun with friends. Of course, they can see me as I run up with this. I have a little icon telling them to attack me. Course taken out. Got some points that'll let you bring this stuff in. Get it? I don't know if I got it there or not. Stay together. Stay together. I got blown up right at that moment. Where 
Where, where the hell's the damn thing? Ah, oh, they're back now. Now fall back. They're closing in on the pallet. Fall back along the path. Long, slow run. It's a beautiful game, though. I am assuming it's going to be better looking in the future. All right, both the ion disruptors are on their way in. Ready to shoot. Get up, dude. We're heading the transport. Come on, get out the That's kinda cool right there. This guy has it, but isn't shooting with it. It's fucking locked, you idiot. Damage to the oh shit. That's something you never want to see, right there. Trooper. I've not used him yet. We're still going to lose this first round here. We're close. Ah, oh, it's just like that guy. Ah, oh, I got sniped just as about to launch a rocket. Bad form. Let's go. We do this together. We can't take out this last five points here. Come on, take it out. Ion disruptor on target. Did we win? Alright, we won this one. Fantastic. Transport destroyed and separatist on the run. <laughs> Patch yourselves up, boys. Won't be long till we redeploy. Or I think you get the point of that mode. Yeah, none of those, obviously. All right, real, we'll, real quick, we'll uh, jump over and take a look at the the Starfighter mode. Uh, I don't, conceptually, I like the idea of it. Uh, I don't care for the flying in it. It's not great. Um, let's get that in a second here. Some long ass loads on this beta. But I think the game has potential. It feels really good. The shooting feels good. Um, it's easy, It's a good looking game. Uh, I just hope it's a little more polished when the uh, final game comes out in about a month. Hey, I said to quit. I quit, and then it dumped me back into the game. That's fucking fantastic. Or maybe it dumped me into the pre-match screen for the uh, for that mode. I don't know. Looks like it, that. Lo that to me looked like a, a failure to quit, which is a problem I had with um. Battlefield 1. Anytime I go to quit a match, it would never quit properly. There we go. Starfighter Assault. Much smaller player field. It's 12 on 12 versus instead of 20 on 20. Uh, the flying doesn't feel great. That's my problem with it. Uh, like, throttle is on the left stick and all the maneuverability is on the right. That just doesn't feel right. It defaults to not inverted, which also doesn't feel right. Like, when you're flying, up should never be up. But that's how it defaults. Uh, it's weird.
All forces repel the rebels' assault. I'm gonna skip that because of music. It shouldn't have had music. All right, so let's. Uh, I think we got cards here to equip. Tuned lasers. All right, and uh, tactical jammer. All right, laser barrage after burner photon tor torpedo. All right, standard stuff. Very long lead-in time. That's one thing I, I don't like about this uh, game at all. Every time you join a match, there's a long lead before you actually get in. Like, let me do all this stuff first, then join the match. Seems fair to me. Yeah, it makes the TIE Fighter noise. See, I don't like how the how the flying feels. I really don't like how the flying feels. Like, especially once you get in this position. It doesn't feel right, kind of correct. And you crash a lot. See? <laughs> it's way too easy to crash. Like, I really want to enjoy this, but, like, see, is, that's, that's the shit I'm talking about right there. Like, left stick, turn, right stick, turn, up is down, down is up, that, that should feel better. Throw it back. I hate killing the AI. Ah, like precision turning is not what this is about. We must not allow them to disable our arms. Well, that should do some damage, damn it. I hit it with myself. Just, mm. I don't enjoy this nearly as much as I feel like I should. The shield generators must be protected. That rebel blockade runner is in critical condition. We've eliminated one of their blockade runners. There we got that. All rebel blockade runners are destroyed. That should slow them down significantly. Target down. Like this is this part right here is where the uh 
Let me crash real quick. Hold on. Expect poor pilots to be weeded out in flight school. Flying into there is where the uh, the lack of turn um, crispness is very noticeable. Because you're supposed to you're supposed to fly into there, and it's way too easy to get yourself turned around. Just isn't as good as it should be. Initiating attack run. Another shield generator has fallen. Ah, uh, some f fucked up flying right there. Oh, good lord. I'm curious as to see if the, uh, the cards burn, like if they're single use. I'll have to check that out after this match. Ah, uh, turn that turn too sharp. I'm a bad pilot, it's as simple as that. Alright, here comes the shield. Generators are gonna be down. Yep, shield generators are down. They just got a whole bunch more ships. Oh, the Millennium Falcons out here. I mean, somebody's actually flying well. Any ships firing on those power caps need to be taken out. Slave one's here. What the hell was that? Probably AI. Since I'm able to hit him, it's probably AI, uh, yeah. Cruiser has jumped out of hyperspace. We can't afford to engage it directly. Keep up defenses and hold for reinforcements. Right on time. What is making that big explosion? Oh, but as you can see, I'm not great at this. Uh, tie, the uh, Starfighter stuff. Flying isn't great. Or I'm not great at it. Although I am, I, I do feel like I'm getting more of a feel for it than I had at the start. I don't think it's as good. Oh, it's fantastic. Back online. Prevent the rebels from disabling the power clamps. None of us can fly, sir. Damn it, Oh, 
shit, I'm good at killing the AI, I guess. Or at least helping kill the AI. Target. Mm. That was some skillful flying, too. This will be the last thing we look at. And it'll be the end of the playtest. Because we're already near in a half hour. And me flying poorly doesn't make for good uh, footage. on my ass. Someone wants to be dead. Shields restore. Protect those power taps. I'll see if I can Oh Morgan Falcon just blew up. Fucking me up. Ah, shit, get AI again. I will say it's much more fun to fly around as a TIE fighter than it is a uh, X-Wing. They just got better sound effects. That was a stupid move on my part. I hit the wrong button. <laughs> Moist Zombie. Nice uh, screen name. And we lost. Alright. We have faced a considerable setback this day. Now oh, they blew up our stuff. was garbage. He's got 24 kills over there. Damn. Alright. So let's quit. Yes, I want to quit. Yes, I want to quit. But that'll be our uh, live plenary playtest of the Star Wars Battlefront multiplayer. Star Wars Battlefront 2 multiplayer beta. I've been corrected by looking at my own screen here. Um, I'm still looking forward to it. I, I think it'll uh, certainly be something worth playing down the line. Uh, they need to work on some things like uh, I've had issues all night with the input. Uh, several times the ability to hit A and select a thing has stopped. Hopefully that isn't a problem with the uh, final release and hopefully they clean up some of the graphics. But I am very much looking forward to this game. Uh, there's a lot of potential here. Uh, loot boxes aside. I'm sorry. Crates aside. Um, I, I don't like that whole element. That's one thing I didn't like about the first Battlefront. Was this uh, insistence on using um, like the cards. The card system. I don't, I don't like the card system. I never have. And I, I'm hoping these crates... They're not too obtrusive as far as their, um, or intrusive rather, and as far as their, like, money. I hope it's not like the situation we're seeing with Forza 7 and, uh, Middle Earth Shadow of War. Uh, that stuff's getting old. And that's besides the point. I'm kind of rambling. I'm tired. It's late at night here. So, um, that's been Battlefront 2's multiplayer beta. It's going to end later today on Monday, uh, it being past midnight now, 
I'd like to thank you for joining me and take a look at the, the two modes, get a feel for what the game has to offer, how it feels. It's Star Wars, it's a first person shooter, it's a lot of fun. I'm just hoping the single player campaign is good uh, since they actually put one in it this year and that people continue to play this for a while because that was, like I said, the big problem with the first Battlefront was there was only a short window where people were actually playing it very quickly. In my experience, did I notice the player counts start to dwindle? Uh, by the time a year rolled around into the game's life, very few people were playing it. Almost never got into a full room at that point. So hopefully this one does better. I enjoyed this, and uh, if you're done watching this and you thought it looks good too, why don't you check it out? It's free for everyone right now. But that's it for now. I'll be back later tonight or earlier this morning, depending on how you look at it, with uh, the Sunday Night Live or the Sunday Night Long Stream. Probably going to jump back into Uncharted 4, try to get, you know, put a hurting on it while I can. But thank you for watching. I'll see you soon.